Hello everyone, I'm Shyam Pasari and welcome to ASIN Academy. And as you can see from the title of this video, in this video we will check which number is larger, e to the power pi or pi to the power e or both of them are equal. Now pause this video over here for 5 minutes and check by yourself and then come back with our answer is it e to the power pi or pi to the power e. I hope that you are ready with an answer. So we have to check which number is larger, is it e to the power pi or pi to the power e. Now I hope that you are aware of the series e to the power x which is equal to x to the power k by k factorial where k starts from 0 and goes up to infinity. So the series is equal to 1 plus x plus x square by 2 factorial plus x cube by 3 factorial and so on and so forth. Now if the series e to the power x is equivalent to 1 plus x plus x square by 2 factorial plus x cube by 3 factorial then I can firmly say that e to the power x is at least greater than 1 plus x. Now e to the power x is greater than or equal to 1 plus x and it is equal to 1 plus x when the value of x is equal to 0. Now this is because if we put 0 in this value then we will get e to the power x is equal to 1 which implies that e to the power 0 is equal to 1. Now this is surely the case, the value of e to the power 0 is equal to 1, so this is true. So at the value of x equal to 0, e to the power x is equal to 1 plus x and for all the others value, e to the power x can directly be written as e to the power x is greater than 1 plus x. Now since we have proved that e to the power x is greater than 1 plus x, in the next step you will surely know that why have we done this step. Now if we put the value of x by pi by e minus 1, then we will get e to the power pi by e minus 1 is greater than 1 plus pi by e minus 1. Now this value is also equivalent as e to the power pi by e whole divided by e is greater than pi by e. Now in this equality you can see that e is in both denominators of LHS and RHS so the both will get cancelled and we will be left with e to the power pi by e is greater than pi. So according to our last step we have found that e to the power pi by e is greater than pi. Now I can write down this very step as e to the power pi whole raised to the power 1 by e is greater than pi. Now you know that if in LHS the power is in the denominator then RHS it becomes in the numerator. So I can write e to the power pi is greater than pi to the power e and thus we have found that e to the power pi is greater than pi to the power e. Now there are various other methods by which you can prove that e to the power pi is greater than pi to the power e. And if you think that you have a better efficient method, then post your method down in the comment section. And if it's really efficient than this very method, then I will post it in the official channels of ASIN Academy. That's all for this video and I hope that you understood all the topics covered in this video. And if you have any doubt, then you can post your doubts down in the comment section. Or you can send your doubts to us to our channel's official Instagram or Facebook page and we will surely solve your doubt as soon as possible. Or you can go to the official website of ASIN Academy and you can send your doubts to us from there. And all the links are provided down in the description. And if you did like the video, then please hit the like button and subscribe to the channel ASIN Academy.